friends, welcome back. Today I want to tell you a quick little story. So the other day I came over to this window to look outside, check on my kids that were riding their bikes back here. They like to go along the little driveway back to buy the green bins and, and then they drive right back up. And I see them stop right over here and get off their bikes and start picking up something. And I just smiled because I knew exactly what they were doing. It was a really windy day and they had found some pine cones. There's, you can kind of see a little bit of one of the big evergreen trees back there. And they had dumped a ton of pine cones on the ground. And my boys had thought of their mother and were picking up pine cones for me. So they brought them in and I today am going to scent them. I looked up a bunch of recipes online on Pinterest. Love looking on Pinterest. And I found there's many different ways you can scent pine cones. Some ways take a month and some ways just take a week so I am impatient and I don't want to wait a month so I'm gonna do one of the kinds that only takes a week so I'm gonna bring you along and show you how I scent my pine cones and then I will show you what I'm gonna do to decorate with them I've got my cookie sheet lined with foil and now I put my pine cones on the foil. And then I'm gonna put this in the oven for, I believe it says 20 minutes. And this is just to kill off any critters that may be still lurking in them, so. All right, they're done baking and what that did it also not only killed any critters that might be in it but it also opened them up some they're all really open now and now I just put them in a baggie and I actually am probably gonna have to have two so I'll put half of them in this baggie and I am glad I used the aluminum foil because there's some sap on it so that helped protect my cookie sheet and I don't think I want to pack them in here too tight there. put the rest in another baggie and then it said a 15 to 20 drops of essential oil and I just got this at Walmart in the health and beauty type aisles so hopefully it works. If I was going to use it for myself, I maybe would buy a more, a better brand, but just for cinnamon pine cones. put in more than what I'm supposed to. And then you're supposed to just leave this sit for a week. So it says one to two weeks, but I'm impatient and it'll be one week. <laughs> so I will be right back here in a second to show you what I'm going to do with them in a week. And we're back. So it has actually not been a week because I'm impatient and I wanted to shoot this video and finish it. <laughs> so I am jumping the gun here and going to go ahead and show you what I'm doing. Um, that just shows how honest of a person I am. I couldn't even lie to you on YouTube that it had been a week. I have to tell the truth. <laughs> All right. So. This is what I've done for this one. I don't know if you can see that very well. 
I put a ribbon on it and I painted the tips. Archer, will you show that really close up to the camera? Nope, climb over there on the chair. And it looks really cute. That's kind of the way on Pinterest that you kind of see them done. And that's cute, but I've decided I don't really like that. So I'm not gonna do it that way. Okay, bring it here. If you do want to do it that way, you can either just tie the string to the top of the pine cone, or you can get these little um, hooks that are for like picture hanging. And you want to show that to the camera? And you can screw that in or hot glue it in to the top. And <laughs> okay, thank you. And use that to put your string or ribbon on and that's cute I just I am touching wet paint that's smart <laughs> I'm just more of a plain person and I have decided that I just want to keep them plain and by the way they smell awesome Can I smell one? Ooh, strong isn't it what's it mm. smell like it smells like a smell. <laughs> what smell is it? I don't know. It's cinnamon. Mm. So I'm just going to leave them plain. And I just decorate plainly. I've got this basket on my table for fall. And I think I'm going to just change this out and put a plain basket up here with these pine cones in, them, in it. And it will just make my whole kitchen and breakfast nook area here smell just delicious all season long. Plus, if I leave them plain, then I can leave them out all winter long until spring and they can just give off their glorious scent until then. If I decorate them like this, it's not a fall decoration. It's not a winter decoration. It's just Christmas, and I want something that will last through the whole season. So, that's what I've decided to do, just leave them plain. So, thanks for watching today, and I hope you'll like, subscribe, and join us in this joy-filled life. Say bye, kids. Bye. bye. <laughs>